African sisters and brothers in the United Kingdom, from your African sisters and brothers in Belize. I'm at Battlefield Park, a historic landmark of resistance for African people. I'm Yaya Marin Coleman, the chairperson of Ubad Educational Foundation, the organization that advocated and lobbied for the government of Belize to declare this August 1st, 2021, the first African Emancipation Day in Belize. I will share with you a bit of history about one of her African ancestors who resisted her enslaver. Her name was Peggy. And this was a trial from 1821, 17 years before the physical emancipation of African people from chattel enslavement. 200 years ago, 1821 to 2021, African ancestor Peggy courageously faced her enslaver, Dr. Mansfield Bowen, a magistrate who accused her of stealing 24 handkerchiefs. As a result, she was tied up and severely flogged and handcuffed and chained in a rat infested shed for five days and nights. Her common law husband, a military pensioner known as Sergeant Rush, interceded on her behalf and promised to pay Boeing an exorbitant sum if the handkerchiefs were not found, and Peggy was released on a Sunday about midday. On Monday, she left Boeing's house to make her complaint and seek redress, and Boeing, learning of this, sent for her and decided to teach her a lesson. An eyewitness declared on looking through a hole, I saw a woman named Peggy fastened to four stakes placed in the ground and laying on her belly, her legs and arms being distended and tied to stakes by cords so that she had no power to alter her position. Her clothes, when I first saw her, were fastened around her hips and after she was flogged some time by a woman with a cat, her clothes were dragged down until they were below the small part of her thigh when the whole of her posteriors were exposed. The woman again flogged her on the posteriors at which I was disgusted that I turned away. Dr. Bowen was present during the whole punishment. Dr. Mansfield Bowen was brought to trial for cruelty to his slave named Peggy. In the trial, the prosecutor requested that three enslaved women, Sarah Thisbe and Nancy, be called to provide evidence against Dr. Mansby Bowen. This magistrate determined that as legally held enslaved people, they could not testify. Despite the injuries to Peggy, the jury found, returned the verdict of not guilty. And the illustration was done by a Belizean woman, black artist named Katie Numi. And so we want to remind our African sisters and brothers in the UK, from your African sisters and brothers in Belize, we're still here. Solidarity forever on this one Messiah, August 2021.